Hello everyone. As you know, today is 28 April, the annual World Day for Safety and Health at Work. On 28 April, promotes the prevention of occupational accidents and diseases globally. It is an awareness raising campaign intended to focus international attention on the magnitude of the problem and on how promoting and creating a safety and health culture can help reduce the number of work related deaths and injuries each of us is responsible for stopping deaths and injuries on the job there are several factors risk factors in the workplace and we should know about that uh, i will tell you the five main hazards or risk factors in the workplace that are physical hazard chemical biological agronomic and psychosocial hazard the first is physical hazard it is a common source of injury in many industries and includes wet floor radiation hazard electrical and vibrational hazard and many more suppose there is a welder and he is doing the welding then he should use personal protective equipment like eye protection safety footwear etc also injuries due to wet floor are one of the main hazard and can be reduced by using proper symbol or sign at workplace that there is a wet floor and you should aware of that symbol second is chemical hazard if you are working in a laboratory or in a chemical industry you should be aware of some factors like which chemical is toxic and which is flammable to reduce accidents or injuries or you have used sanitizer you know it is also a flammable compound and if you are working that type of place you should use or wear lab coat gloves and goggles etc the third is biological hazard as you all know about covid-19 the coronavirus it is an example of biological hazard and as day by day cases are increasing you should have to follow some guidelines to protect yourself and to your family members and i am assuming that you know what you have to do is you have to wear face mask you have to wash your hands properly and you have to use sanitizer after in proper interval the fourth is ergonomic hazard ergonomic risk factors are workplace situations that cause wear and tear on the body and can cause injury for example repetition forceful motion and extreme temperature etc to reduce these type of hazard there should be job rotation and put work supplies and equipment within a comfortable reach and many more the last is psychosocial hazard these are factors in the management of work that increase the risk of work related stress and can lead to psychological or physical harm to prevent this there should be senior management commitment to reducing workplace stress or you can do meditation for your anxiety and stress these are the factors can cause injury at workplace but at your level what you can do is you you can follow some rules some guidelines uh, for example while using car always wear seat belt never drink and drive never jump a traffic signal and many more now i am stopping here by just saying few words uh, think safe work safe be safe thank you